New reaction today from colleagues and friends of veteran journalist Charlie Rose, the latest prominent figure facing sexual harassment allegations. At least eight women have come forward to the Washington Post accusing the news anchor of either sexual assault or sexual harassment. ABC's Elizabeth Hurz in New York with details. And so, as an actor, you're constantly observing. News anchor Charlie Rose suspended from his CBS, PBS, and Bloomberg programs. And to CBS This Morning co hosts yeah. takes a not missing words. This has to end. This behavior is wrong. Period. The reaction coming after stunning and disturbing accusations of sexual assault and harassment lodged against the now 75-year-old TV icon. What do you say when someone that you deeply care about has done something that is so horrible? That said, Charlie does not get a pass here. Eight women opening up to the Washington Post claiming Rose allegedly made unwanted sexual advances towards them. One of his former employees telling the paper he was a sexual predator and I was his victim. One woman that we spoke to who worked for him as an intern in the 1990s recalled him coming out of the shower naked. She confided in one person. You know, the next day a male producer came up to her laughing and said, oh, I heard you got the shower trick. Another accuser, a former assistant, telling the paper there were at least a dozen instances where Rose walked nude in front of her while she worked in one of his New York City homes. She says he would repeatedly call her late at night to describe his fantasies of her swimming naked. Rose is responding in a statement saying it is essential that these women know I hear them and that I deeply apologize for my inappropriate behavior. I have behaved insensitively at times and I accept responsibility for that. Though I do not believe that all of these allegations are accurate, I always felt that I was pursuing shared feelings, even though now I realize I was mistaken. The Washington Post now says since their initial reporting, more women have reached out to them with claims against Rose. Elizabeth Her, ABC News, New York.